Hi, my name is Nitin Rai. I am one of the founder members of the Ragurai Center for Photography and presently also the director of the Ragurai Center for Photography. <laughs> Me and Mr. Raghu Rai, we set up this center for a very specific purpose. We felt since you know digital technology had come in, uh, students were desperately experimenting. Some people were successful in making images, some people were going very wrong in the sense that you know they would convert a color image into a black and white and only leave a certain part as color or people would artificially be boosting up contrast, or people would be mixing five, six images. And the kind of photography that Mr. Raghu Rai has done in all these years, and that I have done and we believe in and we still do, uh, we felt that true to life, pure and unadulterated photography should be passed on to the younger generations. Sure, we are open to new ideas in experimenting with new image, but as long as it works. Being at RRCFP was a blessing in itself. I shall always be indebted for this institution to make me learn to put my heart and soul into that one thing that I love the most and that's photography. Photography has always been my passion, but it was only after some time living in India that I decided to pursue photography as a career. Photography, I learned a lot of things from this place. How do you behave in a professional life? आपको किस तरीके से बाहर जाके शूट करना है आपके कंफर्ट जोन से कैसे बाहर निकलना है इन सब चीजों में मुझे रघु सर नितिन सर रोहित सर सब लोगों ने मुझे काफी हेल्प किया ये एक स्कूल टाइप का माहौल नहीं रहता है यहां पर काफी अच्छा एनवायरमेंट रहता है बीइंग अ फैशन फोटोग्राफ दिस इज वेरी सोच के बारे में सीखा उन्होंने कैसे फोटोग्राफ खेलने से पहले क्या सोचते हैं और अच्छे फोटोग्राफर एक फोटोग्राफ पे काम नहीं करते पूरी सीरीज पे काम करते हैं। It was a tough journey, but though I have gained lots and lots of experiences here and lots and lots of friends, so I am really happy to be a part of this team. If I compare my work from now, before our CFP, it was horrible. I had really enjoyed learning photography in the lap of nature, where there are only trees and trees, no pollution, silent zone. We believe that an image should be so pure and so strong and so powerful in expression that minus any text, it should have the ability to convey to you what the photographer is trying to say. And the idea of this center is that we create higher consciousness amongst young people and take them on a plane which is more sensitive, where they are exploring things at their cost and energy and feeling so that, you know, the images they create are going to be different than what is already happening in the market which is flooded with all kinds of pretty stuff. We set up the center on a farm which is six acres of really beautiful green property and uh, the reason we did that was we wanted to keep the school at a place which is very close to nature. For any creative person, if you are in a beautiful green space with the right guidance from your teachers and with students who are madly and passionately in love with photography, the whole atmosphere that you create would be one of discovering your creative journey as a photographer with the help of our faculty, with the help of our mentor and I would like anybody who is interested in photography should come and visit the centre once.